guys, it's Marissa here, and first of all, I just wanted to start off by saying Happy New Year! Um, I know this isn't my first video of the year, but because I didn't get to say it in my last video, I just wanted to to say it in this one. Um, I didn't think whenever I first um, filmed my unboxing for my fan goods, I didn't think I'd post it up so late, so... Um, yeah, <laughs> that's why. I'm sorry. Happy New Year, guys. Anyways, since it is a new year, I wanted to uh, do an update collection on my photo cards, on my sale and trade photo card video. Um, so yeah, I've cut down like one group, so I'll be selling 17 cards now, and you'll see some of the other, other cards I have up for sale. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so here is my two binders. Um, if you guys remember, I had separated my cards to the cards that are that I'm putting up for sale or trade in this one, and my actual collection in this one. So I actually, let me just start off with my collection album. I had made a wish list of all the cards that I'm missing, and then the ones that are striped out in purple is the one that I have gotten already. So I'm still missing a lot, if you can see. Most of them are BAP. Um, it's not really a lot of group, actually. It's only about four groups. There's EXO, um, Infinite Monster X, um, BTS, and Infinite, or is that five? Anyways, it's just a bunch of versions. See, like, I have a bunch of carnivals that I'm missing, and nor infinite only, and then there's four life, now there's three for life, and I still need to add one more. So, yeah, let's get started. Um, I have decided to put the, my notes here, the notes that I got from trading with a bunch of people. <laughs> I think a lot of them are super cute too, and I probably would not remember, um, who's who. <laughs> because I, yeah, they write their names down on here, but I usually remember their usernames for some reason. It's maybe because that's the first thing I always see. Um, I really need to work on getting an illegit cover, but right now I only have their names on here, but that's okay. Um, here's my Beast collection. It's still the same. I didn't get anything new. Or, and I still... I'm still not thinking about selling them, which I feel like I should, but at the same time, I can't get myself to do it. But, yeah, I probably won't be doing it. Um, these are, I have every card from their album. I don't collect them, so I don't have, like, both versions of whatever album, like, Ordinary or, um... What other albums? Good luck. There's two versions of that. But I have their concert photo cards here. And then the Night Sun card. Um, the Polaroid Soko book. And this is from their limited edition. These are pictures from their um, Midnight Sun Soko book. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I did post a picture about that. It's, I got that whenever I wasn't even a collector, and I just kind of got that because it was beast. Eh. Here is the thing. I don't know what this is called, the card. But it's from their latest album, Ribbon. And next is my EXO collection, which is one of my most favorite collection out of all of my collection. Um... I'm only missing a few more. Of course, there's the Mama A version. And of course, I probably wouldn't be getting that until maybe I am a millionaire of filthy rich. But that won't be happening soon. Um, yeah. Finally completed my Love Me Right cards. And here I'm missing Lucky One, and I will be looking for that as soon as I can. Actually, it is on my wish list, so it is up for trade for any of the cards, by the way. Oh, and I forgot to put this card in the trade binder because I have two of these. I'm, I'm looking for the other one if anybody wants to trade, or um, I'm selling this one too, so I can buy the other one. 
here's more lay cards. Well, here it says Nature Republic, and I'm still missing one more Nature Republic card. So I'll be trying to get that one as well. And here's his Japanese card for Romantic Universe. And then I'm already trading with Tetsu Fairy um, for his Coming Over album, and which I'm super thankful to her about. I cannot say it enough because she really helped me by saving a lot of time by trading with me. These are his um, Sing For You um, cards that I got from trading with someone. And then these cards came with his, their Japanese album. Every time I order them, this is from his biography book. And here's Luhan and Yishi. Ah. His biography. Oh. Oh. And this is their standee. I decided to take it down because they're so old already. But that's really not the problem. I just kind of, I just wanted to change things up in my room a little. So I just took it down. And here's my infinite collection, which I'm still missing a bunch. But I'm still trying to finish one group at, the t at a time first. But whatever I find or whatever I can get, I'll take it. But it's not like I'm in a hurry. So infinite. Um... On this one, I'm missing Myungsoo Season 2. And I'm missing three more cards from their Azure album. Azure? 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 Yeah, I don't know. The Infinite F Unit. And here I'm missing three cards from Infinite only. Um, I should be having the Myungsoo's Black and White on the way but it's still not here yet, but um, I did trade it with someone, so I hope I hope it'll be here soon. It's just my cards get lost a lot, and um, it's... I've lost a bunch of cards last year. It makes me really sad, but yeah. Um, here is the other cards. Um, that's not Mansu or Samuel, but I got it from their units, or their solo al albums, and I decided to keep them. Uh, but Hoya is up for trade for either Myungsoo or Sungyul. Someone did contact me about it, and um, I'm still waiting for her response. So it's it's sort of up on hold right now. <clears throat> Missing Sungyul's Destiny. Oh, oops. Here's their tickets. And their feedback photo card this one is super super damaged it looks okay like this but once you flip it over I don't know if you can see that I bought it like this and I had no idea it was only five dollars so I was like let me just get it since I'm I'm missing it but I had no idea it was so damaged and she sent me pictures and everything but I, I didn't see it in the picture so I couldn't say anything about it and um Here's my BTS collection. I'm just missing Tiz N.O. which I bought. I bought it on Tumblr and I never got it. So I'm still missing it. Here is this other card. I will be selling- oh I forgot to put this card up for sale too. Um, I've decided to only collect their Korean albums and their like special cards and stuff but I won't be collecting their Japanese. And um, at first I was just going to keep it. But then I figured if I keep it, then I'm just going to keep wanting it. So I'm just going to sell my only Japanese card from BTS. Forgot to put that one on there. I should have been more organized. Sorry, guys. I didn't think I had so many cards in here. Well, it's just two, but, but still. Okay, so here's my Born Love cards. I'm very, um, I'm very proud of my BTS collection as well. Because I'm almost finished with it. Here's my other two cards, but I'm actually not thinking about selling them right now. But if anybody wants to buy them, you can like contact me. But it's not specifically up for sale or trade. Here's my part one. These are so cute. This is whenever I decided to really collect the photo cards. Um, before that, I had always just bought them, but but then I decided to really collect them. And yeah. And epilogue is coming out 
So I'll definitely be trying to collect either Taehyung or Jimin. And I'm still waiting for my season's greetings card to come in. I did put that up for trade. And um, I had to check the mail. This is my only live cards from the exhibition. And I thought they were super, super pretty. And let me take them out for you guys to look at. They're really, really pretty. Really, really pretty. And I think I got them for a pretty good price, actually. This is one of my favorite pictures of them. I, she was selling, I think, like her whole collection of the exhibition cards, but I decided to only get the ones I like, even though I like them all, but, um, just like one of each, because, because then I have, I have to take care of other things, you know, adulting is pretty hard, yeah, here's my other live photos from their zip code. Or do I only have Jimin and Taehyung's on the group? Because that's what I collect. And there's Sandy from their season's greeting from last year. Here's your postcard from now three. And their extra postcards and brochures from their album. And here's my BAP. Man, this video is longer than I thought. Oh my gosh. Sorry guys, let me just... I should... Go faster. Okay, so I'm missing all of these. I'm missing a lot of cards in BAP, and then we have like Nor. I got lucky with this one because it's really hard to find someone to trade for BAP. And here's my Yangjie cards, which is not up for sale or trade, even though I don't really collect them, but I, I, I want to keep them. And here you go. Here's the postcards, postcards, postcards from their DVD photo book. Cards. Oh, the that was it. Since you were four, album. I don't know. There's more Polaroids. I've decided. Uh, I I've decided to only collect their albums and like whatever comes with the DVD, and not buy any more extras like this. I need to limit myself now. Until I have a until until later. Now Monster X was a very, very hard, I, like, I don't know if I should have kept them and collect them, or should I just sell them, but I decided to just keep my precious IM cards and collect them. So now I'm looking for two, for his skills he cards, and I have a random Yuta card right here because I'm still thinking if I should collect NCT or not, but I think if I do, I want to collect Tensel, um, 10 or Yuta, so I'm just keeping his cards first. And yeah, that is it. That is it for my collection binder. And now we're going to move on to my still my binder, which is um, a lot shorter, so it'll go by a lot faster. Which is probably the most important part is it's still in trade. Uh, these are the extra cards that I got, that I bought from a store in Dallas. Um, these are my postcards. They are up for sale. Um, in the description, I'll put down the, the prices and stuff. So you'll know how much I'll be selling them for. Usually the shipping, um, the shipping really depends. Cause if it's if it's a bigger postcard like this, it will be more expensive. Um, I've had to see. Okay, let me show you guys. If it's for a bigger card, I'm gonna have to send them in one of these so I can protect them. And if it's overseas, they cost about $13, and I'm not even joking. I'm not even exaggerating. I I have, like, receipts to prove it and everything, which I don't really understand why it's $13, but it comes with the tracking and stuff. I've never tried to see if the tracking works, but it does come with it. Um, I'm not really sure how much it would be to send it domestically um, with those types of envelopes, but I guess we'll find out if anybody is interested. Okay, so, uh, oh, sorry. Here's my BTB cards, uh, my two infinite cards. Hoya just really loves me. Every time I always get Hoya. And then my first, or second muster cards, or is it first muster? No, oh, well, it's a zip code card. I forgot. Man, my brain isn't working. Uh, my sister cards. I love sister. I'm still gonna buy their albums, but I've decided to not collect them. 
um, to limit myself to collecting cards, and I think that would be a lot easier for me. Here's my two pulls from Monster X. They're up for sale. Or trade. Hook and my SM cards. There's Jomi, Key, and Tail. Taemin, and I'm putting my Luhan cards up for trade slash sale because um, I decided to not collect them anymore. If I do, then that's just another set that I'm going to have to worry about when I'm almost finished collecting these things. And then he still has his solo in China, and they all have photo cards too, and I'm pretty sure they're like expensive AF. And then here's uh, my VAP photo cards that are up for sale and trade. And then we have Suho's Nature Republic and Teen Tops cards. And then we have 17 cards that are for sale and trade, and plus these two. Yeah. And then we have um, Him Chun's Dandy, which I have never used before. So, yeah. Okay, and that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, I'll put some the links in the, de in the description box. And if you guys have any questions, then please feel free to ask me. Um, I'll see you guys soon. Bye!